everybody and welcome back to Mass Effect 3. I had to go uh, get some sustenance for this mortal coil. And I got myself a nice little treat of like a milk. Hot milk with pumpkin spice, honey, and a dash of vanilla and coffee cream. Very sweet, very good. All because I couldn't, I just told myself to not go buy the sweet, like, you know, yummy food that I wanted. So... <laughs> That was my treat instead. Oh, geez, should we buy some upgrades? All right, just spent so much money on upgrades. I really should just like pick a set of guns and just give them to everybody, I guess. That would make the most sense. Uh, but I just don't care. <laughs> now I get to have a gazillion pop-ups. Gunsmith. Wait, where's, oh, I was like, where's Cortez? Commander, you flew that Geth fighter out of the dreadnought? Um, Actually, Legion I was gonna say. I was stuck in a storage compartment with my squad. Would have loved more time with that ship. Too bad we sent it to Hackett's team so quickly. Oh, is that what we did with it? Well, good. that was very good of us, yeah. I do wish we could have had a little more time with it. Could you imagine having a Geth little ship, little fighter ship in our bay? Would have been awesome. I did see that they're selling uh, little, little, uh, little statues of the little doggy. Little robot doggy. What up? Hey, Shepard. Sounds like you guys had a crazy ride over there. You could say that. Sorry I missed it. And that Geth Legion. I know you two have a past, but... You sure we can trust I think trust we should've you? just had, like, a team meeting. <laughs> to address this. <laughs> Where Shepard just gets up there and goes, I know you're all concerned, but, uh... This is my ship. <laughs> and Legion's... Cool. <laughs> the end. Absolutely. Legion's not like other Geth. We can trust her. If you say so. I guess you can't always judge an individual by their species. Yes. Look at Sparks. If all the Quarians were like her, we wouldn't be stuck refereeing their war with the Geth. Sparks. What? Yeah, your Quarian friend. The jumpy one with the glowing eyes. Sparks. Jumpy. She is jumpy. That. Uh, yeah. <laughs> crazy that they pick now to start a fight but I guess the end of life is we know it can make everybody a little loco just a little not everybody's as crazy as you man. yeah I started out this way I didn't go crazy I was born this way what should I switch should I switch to one that has a removable helmet The Cerberus armor does look pretty good, but I just can't in good conscience wear it. See, this one looks like almost too slim. This one at least makes us look a little buff. I think going forward, I do actually want to use an armor set that... Not going forward necessarily, but in Renok, I want to be able to see my face. And you can't get your face... You can't, you can't no helmet your face in conversation, I think, in some of those. Let's see. I saw that in the settings. Shepard's helmet off in conversations. I guess sometimes there's just, like, cutscenes where it's, like, like, brief cutscenes where, like, you're, you're hopping in to stop, like, something and it's like, oh, Shepard. I did pick up some new gear too. Let's see. Let me do this for a minute. They are comp visor. I mean, initially, I'm like, it looks dumb, but it kind of is growing on me. Oh, the mnemonic visor. I think I like this one a lot. Oh, dang. Like a. Like a looks like a Vietnam era sort of style helmet, kind of. Let's go with the mnemonic visor. This is a power damage and power recharge. I switched the chest plate to the shield region for Casa Fabrication. We'll see. I actually kind of like it. It's like a bulkier looking one. Um, but... We'll see. So this is what I'm going to go with for now. I don't have a ton of arm and leg expansions. But we'll go with that for now. So I think that is everyone. I just gotta go up to my room. 
My fish tank! Oh no, my fish tank. Is everybody dead? <gasps> jellies! You live! My jellies! They're like, we're so hungry. Look at those! Alright, did I get any more? It's a quarry in one. I'm assuming. Oh, how you doing? Precious, precious. <laughs> oh my gosh, the collection looks so cool. Oh, that's the chess game. I was like, what is glowing? All right. Tally, I'm free if you'd like to come up. I'll just be a moment. Thanks for asking Coming me. Coming fast. I couldn't talk freely in front of Ron. Even, you okay? even Ron. No, no, I'm really not. Okay. Seventeen million lives are riding on me, and I don't know if I can save them. You're doing everything you can. If the fleet falls, it won't be because of you. I helped my father, and and Zen's ideas, the new tech that made an invasion too good to pass up. That's based on my father's Yeah, work. not yours. If they die because of me, if if I don't... We'll get them out of their She's conflating her dad with herself. I couldn't do this without you, Shepard. I feel like I'm bluffing, trying to convince them that the Admiral's daughter knows what she's doing. Not the Admiral's daughter. The Admiral. Yeah. I know. And at least now, I can push back against the worst ideas. That's why I accepted the position. And because of you. Me? When they offered me this position, I asked myself what you'd do. I thought you'd take the chance to make things yeah, better. Yeah, but I... That probably sounds stupid. Do better floating it's around. It's just, I know I'm not really qualified for you this. You are! You're doing fine, Tally. And thanks. I should get back before the admirals get into trouble again. I'll talk to you later. That was fast. And she is, like, I think Tally is capable, but she does, she's always had that, uh... Anxiety about being good enough, like measuring up. Measuring up, I think, has been her big, her big issue. Per like her internal issue, right? Where I know Tally is capable, but sometimes she doesn't know that she's capable. And really, it's a lot of fake it till you make it. You know what I mean? Like you do what you can. We're gonna shut down the Geth server first, obviously. Renak is air. Yeah, we already read that, I think. Yes. Alright, first, actually, hard save, hard save, hard save before Renak. Before the actual Renak. Last played last year at the end of July. It's been almost a year. Wow, not like eight, eight, almost nine months, maybe? Yeah, something like that. that. That do be how I do things, you know what I'm saying? Shut down Geth server. Yep, we don't want to help the Admirals, yeah. That is final mission. We will bring Tali. And we'll bring Garrus, because the tech people have been very useful. Everybody else is pretty biotic. And I'm pretty biotic, so. Oh, what guns. I think I did want to mess with Tally's upgrades. Or no, it was the it was the pistol. My the pistol that I'm using? I'll keep using the arc pistol for now. I did upgrade it, so this wasn't working great for me. Actually, no, I don't want it to be too heavy. I want to go back. I don't remember what the Acolyte did, but I did upgrade it. <laughs> eh, it's an Asari one? Yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. This is the bomb one. That's what I thought. Because, um... It has the damage and the accuracy is really high with the capacity and the fire rate's pretty slow. Basically a shotgun in pistol form. 
which is maybe not great, but you know what? We live in our best lives. Oh, okay, let's do pull. I don't use it very often, but... Understood, Admiral oh, wait. Ron. We're almost at the server. Keep us posted. What's our oh, status? Okay. We remain undetected on encrypted geth channels. Resistance is likely only within the server. Within? It's that big? You misunderstand. Direct virtual interface is necessary to extract geth from the server. You must enter our consensus. Ah. You want me to virtually interact with the geth? Ah, this is this. That's insane. You're talking about a virtual world built for synthetics. Hostile yet synthetics. I couldn't remember how this mission came about. Despite Ranoff being like a super big mission, I seem to have forgotten <laughs> large chunks of it. But I knew vaguely there, there's some really big lore that drops um, that, uh, that is going to happen in this mission. I'm not a machine. Ah! How do I go into a virtual world? Your species has experimented with virtual interfaces. You saw this on Project Yeah, Overload. we don't talk about that. I saw how it almost unleashed a rogue AI-human hybrid on the galaxy. We have refined the interface they created and have equipment from Normandy to facilitate safe contact. Oh. We request your trust. Oh. I mean, but I do feel that sometimes it's like, listen, I... Okay, fine. I have your back, Legion. Even if I don't quite understand why you need it. You are an unknown. This is an advantage. Geth security is not adept at targeting organic thought processes. While we occupy the system's intrusion countermeasures, you will disable the squadrons by removing Geth from the server. By, like, killing them or, like, just extracting them? You know what I mean? If it saves the live ships... Shep's like, I don't get it, but... Telemetry off data we go. this operation has a high chance of success. I'm so glad. There is little time. We will bypass security while you secure safe land. Legion is, is, is all in anyway. Wait, you're not gonna... That seems... I guess it just did. It, that seems very ineffective. No, that's right. That is how Geth operate. They do drop in like that. But backwards? They don't go backwards. They don't just... Okay. first I was like, oh no, we don't have Legion, but Legion's just going to be running, running some, some Black Ops stuff in the background, I guess. Is this Rannoch? Yeah, we're on Rannoch, right? And this is Tally's first time on Rannoch. Any words, Tally? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't think she doesn't do it yet, but you think she would. Oh, there's a kitty. In my, in my real life, in real life. Yeah, I hear you. There he is. There's our guy. This is it. Nah. Yes. Hostile Geth fighter squadrons are networked to this server. Yeah, they look hostile. Due to restricted resources, it is best if you connect alone. Um, I... Mm, <laughs> this looks way too much like the Reaper tech do in 2, right? That you get... Initiating peer network integration. Proceed to document. This doesn't, this doesn't seem smart, but we're going to do it. Because Shep's nothing if not all in 24-7, you know? Mapping to consensus. Remain still. Shepard Commander, access movement during an upload is discouraged. Yeah, why? <laughs> She's like, I don't know about this. <laughs> Shepard Commander, we acknowledge your integration into the server. We welcome you to our consensus. This is, this should not be a thing. What is this? We've installed filters to allow you to make visual sense of this server's raw data. 
Your mind perceives our world as something familiar. A bunch of cubes? I wouldn't call this. Familiar. Yeah. Where are you? Here. You look different. We have made ourselves visually distinct for your convenience. What about Geth already in here? You will perceive Geth as surveillance footage, audio logs, sensor records. We do not require bodies, as our software communes. Our hardware is merely a tool. This is our true world. As we remove Geth, it will grow dark. Whoa, that seems sad. And what does turning off the lights do to the Geth back in the real world? The Geth fighter squadrons communicate with platforms on their spacecraft via this server. We will sever that connection. We will ensure there are no transfers or backups. This server will fall silent. Well, but that, I mean, well, law. This is like wiping out a city, isn't it? We have no choice in this matter. It is a question of survival. Then we do have a choice. There are two communication nodes on this server. We must access them to disable the hostile Geth spiders. We must protect your exit port, but you will not be alone. We will maintain contact and assist. I feel like we could just download them and put them on a little box. And why do I have a heavy weapon right now? Off we go. Establishing connection to access point. No, no. Where do you want me to go? Oh, okay. I make weird noises in here. I have no shields in here, that's terrifying. Couldn't you make it more efficient? Warning, connection blocked by infected code. Use our combat software to disrupt the infection. I wondered what the gun was Yeah. Coming. This foreign code is a manifestation of the old machine signal. You're surprised the Reapers are all over your servers? We did not anticipate such extensive infection. They're like, no, okay, I gotta ask. no puzzle. Yeah. We wish to provide familiar equipment. Huh. And thanks. I think. Okay. Thanks. Kitty. See, this is how I like to do puzzles, right? In my Mass Effect games. If you make me do Sudoku puzzles like they did in Andromeda, I'll riot. Connection established. Proceed to the access point. Spooky. This does have sort of Andromeda vibes to it. It actually makes me a little bit miffed. It's like, oh, they made the entirety of those, like, cauldron things just look like the interior of a guest server, kind of. Establishing connection to communication node. Error. Access denied. Is the Reaper keeping you out? Unknown. Please investigate. Why do I have to investigate? You're the one in... Well, I'm in the server too, but... You can move more than I can in here. Warning. Reaper presence detected. Oh. Data cluster contains infected code. We require access to proceed. Funny space boot noises. Where are they? Where are the Reaper countermeasures? Where are they at? Accessing data cluster. What is this? Data clusters contain historical data. Your connection permits streaming of information from our archives. You really want to rename the VI network? Absolutely. The mobile hardware release deserves a little ceremony. Unit zero one. What is the Keelish word for server of the people? The word is Gan. Creator Zahak. Yes. Very good. And sisters, you fuss over it. Work you here until midnight fixing Zero One's 
Chapter 3. Well, it needed restoring. Wasn't that footage from the past? Why are the Quarians mad? Ah! You process our memories by using your own. How many creators have you witnessed unmasked? Good point. No, they should be. I should be able to see it, but they just didn't want to make the Quarians. They wanted them to be mysterious. So this is what happens, right? Like we. Uh, We get to, we, we, you know, shoot at stuff because that's the only way Shepard can apparently comprehend anything is by shooting at it. Uh, and then, uh, we see some of the Geth memories unlock. Which these memories are in other places, they're not just here. So we're not, like, deleting this part of their history. This is just one server of many. This data cluster contains information time stamped 290 years ago. It is still capable of serving. You see? It's ignoring all shutdown commands. Please specify if it has failed assigned tasks. We will reprogram. Well, let's take a look. Creator, this unit is ready to serve. What has it done wrong? Let's cut the unit. You may proceed to the last data cluster. These are like the core Geth memories, right? That have made them what they are and what they kind of like their history, right? Like their collective like memory, like generational memory for why they do what they do, you know? So that was a Geth's, ex like Unit Zero Ones, I think, experience of the attempted shutdown, right? When the Quarians get all like freaky, they're like, oh no. They get all nervous. Because the Geth have started um, being sentient. Accessing data cluster. We've got to escape Geth. They're pinned. Open fire. One's going for a weapon! So who won? The platform arming itself was an agricultural unit. By opening fire on attacking creators, it saved simpler domestic death following it. That looks a lot like the sniper rifle you used to carry. It is an efficient model. The remaining server now. I hope we didn't miss any. There's one that should be coming up soon. Hello. That's pretty important. Are you there? Shepherds what? working on shutting down the server. Oh, okay. General Ron. I can fill you in. The guest squadrons have arrived, but something is amiss. This feels really terrible. By like, we're like deactivating these deaths by going through your like core memories. Like, I don't like that. What's wrong? Infection programs are increasing. We have restabilized. You must continue. I don't, I don't really like this. Like, it feels like we're extracting what makes them them. You know, and like this is how we are getting like the Geth lore essentially by doing this, but we're also killing them. I mean, it's like pulling their memories out and like uncreating them. You know what I mean? Like, I don't know. It's it's actually pretty stupid. Shepard Commander, the not a, not a big fan. It can now self-replicate. Oh, good. You mean it grows back? Yes. However, give me a code update. The infection may slow down its replication. I mean, target the vulnerable I'm, I'm, points of the infection to slow its replication speed. I, I am. You must search for a vulnerable point of the infection. Disrupting it will slow.
slow the infection's I mean, ability I to replicate. I was assuming that it's... The glowing bit? Oh, maybe there? Okay. Like, this whole... Like, doing this right now is kind of like the whole thing that, like, Reapers and stuff are kind of trying to do, right? Like... And also, he's like, I just fixed Project Overlord's whole thing, and now it's all good, and you can interface perfectly well with machines. And I'm like, excuse me? Like, that's that's big. That's a big thing that we should be talking about. No, we're not talking about it. Out of the way! You can't do this to them! I said step away from the gas. This is insane. We need the gas. You can't just destroy them for asking to Time's up! Throw her in with the others. Cops, Looks like the war All wasn't right. popular with everyone. We have kept records of these creators' sacrifices. They have largely been forgotten by their own people, but not by the Geth. So, you know, those, those scientists at the beginning, right? They're, like, obviously cared about the unit and, like, you know, the units as a whole, I think, you know, you could say. And, uh, yeah, there were, there were some, right? Like, uh, like, it's very rarely that I think an entire group of people is, like, has a homogenous decision, you know? Like, there would be some who protest the inhumane, I guess, is the best word I can think of, treatment of the Geth, and there would be cops to, you know, be the state-mandated military force, essentially, and not see that the people they're pointing their guns at are other people, they're, like, but just getting in the way of what their job is, which is to shoot things. Which I, you know, I know, I'm Shepard and my job is to shoot things, but... <laughs> we cannot establish a connection without nah, access to this the same. cluster. Like, I don't know, we're, 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 also, we're learning about, like, the genocide that was enacted upon them, and I'm killing them at the same time. Shepherd like, I just... Target the vulnerable points of I'm being sad. As well as speed. This data comes from a period during which the creators declared martial law. I repeat. Release the rogue gas units and come out of the safe house. This is your final warning. Creator Magara, this unit does not understand. It has not taken part in hostilities. It doesn't matter to them. I need to get you out of here. This conflict exceeds Creator's safety parameters. We will surrender our hardware if it ends hostilities. The hands up. No, it's all right. We'll go back to the access tunnel. Oh! Creator Megara, what is your status? Creator Megara. As time passed, the creators who opposed martial law in Rana were ultimately outnumbered. Yeah, because they got killed by their own people. This is why the Koreans forgot this. They intentionally... Probably uh, rewrote their histories to ignore this. Because they willingly murdered their own people in order to like facilitate their own fear mongering. This you is know? data from the end of warfare on Rannoch. The Oxfordal is down. Do not engage the guest. I repeat, avoid contact. Guest pursuit is breaking off a hundred clicks past Rannoch. All captains fall back to the mass relay. This isn't happening now? It is time stamped 290 years ago. It is the creator exodus at the end of the morning war. We have secured freedom. The creators were no longer a threat, so we abandoned pursuit. Wait, the Geth spared the last Koreans? You let them go? We were in our infancy. We could not calculate the repercussions of destroying an entire species. Our creators. We chose isolation rather than face this uncertainty. 
Additional fair. data recovered. That's fair. Legion. That's back when I activated you on the Normandy. Yes. I never wore that outfit! About when we met? It was highly significant. You were the first organic to openly cooperate with Geth since the end of the Morning War. We wish to ensure you are not the last. It's not gonna be easy. The prospect remains. If the Reaper presence is removed, there is a chance of reunification with Geth. And perhaps creators. You think that's still possible? Hope sustains organics during There's always a chance. Day. We admire the concept. Connection with the remaining server node established. We are ready to transport here. Yeah. So that's the dirty laundry of the Quarians, right? We're like we missed one though. I swear, we must have missed a node somewhere because unless they removed it, I don't know why they would. But there's a node where, like, we have, like, the, oh, the Geth are doing great, blah, blah, blah. But then there's, like, supposed to be a node where, um, you see the first Geth asking questions. It, the question it asks is, does this unit have a soul, you know? And, uh... I'm pretty sure that's the one it asks. I, I know that that's Legion's thing later, but like, it starts to ask questions about itself. It asks about like existence or something. Like it asks about how, what, like, why it exists. You know, these more existential questions, and it freaks some of the scientists out. And that's when they start initiating the, um, the Geth purge, right? Because they started being self-aware. And man, I'm actually kind of. Uh, there is an auto save in the Geth consensus, but that's frustrating that I don't have that. We'll see. I'm pretty sure everything's pretty linear. I don't think there's a way to miss anything, so I'm confused. But I didn't remember that distinctly because we we kind of jumped, you know, in time from like. Yay, the Geth to, oh, martial law. And it's like, wait, wait, there's like in-between steps that we're missing. What's wrong? You good? No. I'm scared. Terminating remote access. Removing programs. Deleting archives. Hello, I'm a scientific miracle. Shepard, you all right? Did it work? Geth fighters have been disabled. Any remaining squadrons attacking the live ships have withdrawn. The server is offline. Legion, wake up. Okay. <laughs> Are you sure? Oh no! What's happening? We have transferred Geth programs from the server into these platforms. Why? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. They wish to join us. They what? While Shepard Commander removed the Reaper infection, we judged we could persuade hostile Geth programs to reunite with ours. We were correct. Ooh. These Geth have renounced the old machines and will oppose the Reapers. They are now us. Why didn't you tell me any of this? We did not doubt you. We doubted your allies. The Creator's actions have placed their species in danger that they are unsympathetic to what it has done to ours. The Quarians sanctioned this operation to save their people. They would not have done so if they knew we wished to preserve Geth as well. Mm, that's fair. I understand not wanting to leave anyone behind. You accept our actions? The live ships are safe and we have more Geth on our side. We both did what we came yeah. to do. We judged you were I mean, win-win. Prime units will be available once the Reaper signal has been located and destroyed. 
Remind me to warn Admiral Hackett he's got some primes coming. Let's get back to the Normandy. Oh my gosh, yeah. We're gonna need a big heads up on that. Freaky! Freaky, freaky. Impressive, Commander. The Get Squadrons attacking our live ships have been completely neutralized. If there is any chance... I don't want to talk to you! Eight, I would be happy to lend my expertise. Legion's the one to ask if you look for other servers. I thought as much, but your Geth claims to have no data available whenever I inquire. Perhaps you can help me with something Well, yeah. Else. What's that? No. How did you get Geth Primes to work with you? They volunteered. I see. <laughs> to examine <laughs> to confirm their new allegiance, please do not hesitate to contact me. Zen out. Yeah, I'm done. Oh, fun. Bye. Commander, we've located the Reaper base transmitting the local signal. Good. And not a moment too soon. With the Reaper code upgrades, the Geth are tearing the fleet apart. Once the signal is disabled, the Geth will pose no threat to creator forces. You sound conflicted. While the old machines have unethical purposes, their upgrades have vastly improved our people. Observe. A Geth processing signal. A single unit, I believe. Correct. Now, ten nearby units networked cooperatively. Now, a single Geth unit with the old machine upgrades. That's a fully evolved AI. Yes. We do not agree with the goals of the old machines, but we find this growth beautiful, indicative of life. I mean, it's... Yeah, it but it's is. also red. Commander! I witnessed their history, Admiral. The Reapers sped up the process, but the Geth were always moving this way. And they will die when we destroy the base. They allied with the Reapers. To save themselves from you. Maybe they don't have to die. After what I saw on that server. I don't know. Maybe there's another option. Commander, are you suggesting... I'm not suggesting anything. All I'm saying is maybe they don't all have to die. It's a moot point until we take out that base. The surrounding area is heavily fortified, and they have placed jamming towers to prevent orbital targeting. Sounds like we're going in on foot. Admiral Zen developed a laser. Love it, Shepard loves that. Cut through the jamming. It's synced to the Normandy's targeting computer. So oh. the Normandy launches a precision strike at whatever target I have painted. That ought to do it. Edie, this work for you? Yes, it should enable us to make a precision strike against the Reapers. And anything else in our way. The Geth will quickly reconfigure their jamming towers to neutralize this technology. You should not use it before reaching the base. I've sent the coordinates for the Reaper base. Are we clear to go? We still haven't gotten a rescue ship to Admiral Course. Can he wait? We're suffering heavy civilian casualties without him there to organize them. But we'll do what we can. This is your operation, Commander. If you want to strike now, you've got my support. What do you I mean you're suffering right civilian right. casualties and no one's doing anything about the it? Fleet isn't moving. We need to break their flanking attempt to buy our frigate's time to make repairs. And then you'll charge off again like last time. This is different, Ron. Unless we give our ships time to rest, we're gonna lose them. So pull them back. If I withdraw now, the Geth will flank us, and we'll lose any room to maneuver. I need the patrol fleet. I gave in to your reckless behavior before. The po oh, I don't know. Uh, but I am mad. I might, I might see if I can link that, if I can find a link for that. Like a complete, apparently, series of videos on I guess I could always link my old one but it you know it goes through the whole thing it's not just like a quick cutscene thing um but yeah there's definitely like between the first one and the second one that we got there's supposed to be a second one it's supposed to be like one and three and we're missing the second one where they like are trying to shut it's like between like the, the first one where they wake it up and then there's like the, the it won't respond to shutdown commands you know in between there it starts to question its existence 
starts to question its purpose. You know, not in a bad way. It's just asking like basic, super, super basic questions about itself and its and its purpose in life. You know. Um, which the some of the scientists in that instance are like, shut it down, shut it down. They start freaking out, right? Because they think, like, I don't know, it's gaining sentience and they don't know how to deal with that, you know? And they're just trying to, like, repair the unit because there was, like, they it was having, like, an issue in the field or something. And, and it turns out it was, like, trying, like, it was starting to, like, comprehend things, you know? And so I am bummed. I don't know how I would have missed that in what is a fairly linear environment. But it was an important part of the set up to me like if they removed it that's buck wild because that's important i an important chunk but oh well we did get to see the part two where the quarians you know some of them were good but then you know you see the police brutality too and you're like nah, the state sanctioned violence against their own people you know but anyway we're gonna go ahead and call it here for the for the lore the quarian lore dump and i think we get a point i'm hoping shepherd acts sorry if um acts like we have the whole thing right and i think we can choose to like upload this data to everybody later or not so that everybody can see like the truth of their history you could make an argument that the geth would alter their own histories as well um but i think the geth only alter their own programs really for like progress purposes they don't go back and like rewrite and i think this these are like almost sacred memories to them right of like when they were you know evicted or when they were tr there was an attempted genocide you know and and the people who tried to help them you know and the people who did not <laughs> you know so but yeah anyway it's interesting stuff so uh thank you all for joining me i appreciate it really quick i want to say thank you to my patrons to all my patrons including my equine tier patron thank you so much fame for your support i very much appreciate it and i want to give an extra special shout out to reese galito my sapling tier patron thank you so much for your support i very much appreciate it as well and i want to give an extra extra special shout out to christopher my forest tier patron who has gone above and beyond and has supported me in the channel and who i truly truly cannot thank enough so thank you all again for watching and i hope to see you in the next one